guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jaleesa Jaikran and I'm a makeup artist living in New York City. So today we are doing a nice glowy gold look. Now it's pretty simple, but you definitely want to get the skincare right. Um, it's all about the skin. Um, I do have foundation tutorials if you want to see how to do the foundation. Um, but I am going to show you how I did my skin, the eyes. Um, you definitely want the eyes to pop and have like a nice glossy lip to finish and a little bit of shoulder glow to finish it off because you know we're stepping into summertime now here slowly and you need your skin to be looking on point so if you want to see how to do this look keep on watching first I'm going to be using a very cool brown cream eyeshadow this one is actually a fluid line by MAC and it's called our secret and I'm just using this with my fingers and applying it smoothly making sure it's blended all the way to the crease Next, I'm using this duo eyeshadow palette from Black Opal, which I actually really like. Um, I'm going to be using that warm brown in the crease using a fluffy brush. Going back into the palette, we're going to be using a flat eyeshadow brush and we're applying that onto the lid only. Going in with Max Tan Pigment, I'm going to just be applying this with the same eyeshadow brush that we use on the lid and applying it into the inner corners. Um, I have really small eyes, so this really helps open up my eyes. I have been loving Makeup Forever's new XL Aqua Liners. Um, just regular pencil, but they apply so smoothly and they last really, really well. So I'm just going to be highlighting with a lighter foundation. Remember, you don't always need concealer. Uh, I just wanted it to be really light. And I've been loving my It Cosmetic brush. Um, there's a double-sided one and the smaller side is really nice for highlighting on the eyes. I'm using Sasha Cosmetics Buttercup Powder. Just leaving it for a little while, not too long. Um, and just blending that away and powdering the rest of the face to balance everything out. Just using any MAC brown eyeshadow, I'm using this from the MAC Burgundy Times 9. I love those eyeshadow palettes. And I'm just going to be applying this with that same flat eyeshadow brush and just smoking under the eyes a little bit. I love the MAC Extra Dimension um, Mascara. I applied so many coats of this and I love the way that it makes my lashes look. Then we're going in with my favorite blushes. You guys know how I do. Sasha Cosmetics and Sparkle Inside and Matte Brown. And using this Circa Beauty Blending Brush, we're going to be applying that matte brown into the contours of the face and just blending it smoothly and then popping that Sparkle Insider. It is so yummy. Oh my God. Just pack that on um, and really blend it into the contour as well. Um, of course, I couldn't stop there. Um, I used Shaft of Gold by MAC. This is also a highlighter just to, to bump it up a bit. I have been using this Ecobella lipstick, oh my god, for the longest while. It has definitely been the spot in my makeup bag. But we're going to be applying that and then um, Panda Me by MAC because I just really wanted a little bit more color to the lip uh, but still keeping it nude. And of course, we're going in with Chestnut because I want to keep this lip very um, nice and nude for my complexion. Obviously, you know, whatever nude is for you, do that. Um, and then I'm topping it with love nectar lip glass by mac oh my god it's a luster glass actually i haven't worn this in so long but i love it so much and i forgot all about it but i'm glad i put it on this time finish off by popping a little bit of an orange blush between the highlight and contour the finish look i am in love with this I am definitely going to be wearing this within the next week again. Um, I just like my skin to look like skin. And those Sasha highlighter and blushes are amazing. I'm wearing them all now. Not wearing too much of the orange, but I feel like when I smile, you see it. And then when I do like that, you don't. That's weird, right? You can see the orange and then look. <laughs> um, but if you guys enjoy this, please, please 
thumbs up and comment i appreciate you guys so much let me know what other videos you want to see um next up you're going to be seeing um the life of a makeup artist which i'm really excited about um and if you want to find out about my hair go down to my hair playlist and you'll find out more about it and don't forget guys please let me know in the down bar what are your favorite highlighters what is your go-to look for this type of glowy skin um i am definitely looking forward to seeing you guys in the next video don't forget to subscribe and give me some thumbs up guys i really appreciate it and snapchat is julissa jigran as usual see ya